My friends and I took 10 power moons and hit them from each other in Super Mario Odyssey. Today, I'll try to find all 10 power moons that my friend Amethyst hit, and Amethyst does a lot of Super Mario Odyssey modding. Alright, so here we are at the Luncheon Kingdom. I wonder if maybe there'd be something back here. Let's have a look over here. Anything up here? Anything back here? Hmm. Whoa! Oh! Hold on! Do I- I have a timer to get there? I don't even know where that is! How am I supposed to get there? What's going on here? I- I don't know any Mario Odyssey speedrunning movement. I don't know what the fastest way to get there is. Where is that even? How long do I have to get there? I think it's over there? Where was that? <laughs> oh, and there's a Goomba switch over here! Okay. No, I don't know where the moon is! I've really got to see where this goes. Where is this? Let's see where this goes. Oh, it's back there. Okay, okay, okay. I think I've got a better idea of where it is now. I think it's behind that there. Is it behind that cliff over there? I think that might be where it is. What's the fastest way to move in this game? Oh, no. Well, that's not how. Now then, anything up here? Okay, so there's normally a moon up here, I know. So the moon that was here is no longer here. Wait a minute. Ah, I thought that was a moon right there. I was tricked. I thought this was one of the moons. I saw the color. I thought it was a moon. Yes, there's a moon! Okay, 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 we found a moon! We have found a moon! There's a moon right down there! Okay, great hiding spot. Alright, let's just capture one of these. And we'll want to make our way across like this. Oh, no! Okay, and there we go! Okay, and we can get the moon! We got the moon! What number moon is this? Hide and seek moon number seven. Alright, we have got a moon! That is so nice, it is so nice to... Finally, get a moon. Let's see, is there going to be something over there, perhaps? Nope, just some fruits over here. Okay, not seeing... Wait a minute. Okay, I thought that was a moon. Not seeing anything up here. I did see a moon right there. There was a moon up there. Uh-oh. I think that was a moon up there. As we teleported away, I'm pretty sure I saw a moon there. Oh, ah, I keep thinking this, these things are moods! The color of that, it looks like the color of a moon. It makes me think it's a moon. Oh, wait. I think there was one up there somewhere. I think I saw one up there. Can I see one from here? I can't see it from here. Let's see if maybe we want to go over there. There's a moon over there. There's a moon over there. I saw the moon. I saw the moon. Okay, I know where the moon is. I, I jumped! I jumped! Please! No! We were so close! We were so close to it! Somehow I managed to jump when I landed on it. I didn't know you could do that. Okay, I think going from that side is the way to go. I don't think you can get it from this side. We made it! We made it! We made it! Please! Please! Why did you not get the moon, Mario? Why? What if we try to go even more this way? Like this. And, and, no! Oh! I don't know how much control you have over where you slide here. It's so difficult to get that moon. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, now then, please Mario! Yes! Yes, 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 we got it! Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. That was a little bit tough, and I really wonder if there's an easier way to get that one. I wonder if I was making that more difficult for myself than it had to be. Wait, how in the world am I going to bring three Goombas over here? Are there even three Goombas in this level? Okay, let's step on this switch. Now we are going to want to head to that moon, and we are going to want to head there very quickly. I can't tell if this is faster than just running normally. Bounce across to that roof. Let's head this way. Okay. Oh, no. Don't want to fall or something. Okay, you know what? Let's go this way because this is... We are cutting at an angle, so this should be faster than going straight, theoretically. It's a long jump across because there was some guy that was telling us that long jumps go faster than just regular running. Okay. And now then, how in the world are we going to get to over there quickly? Okay, not falling into the lava, so that is good. 
Now, can we make it? Can we? What? We got it? Oh my goodness! And there is hide and seek moon number one! If you don't know any speedrun movement at all in Super Mario Odyssey, then that can be pretty difficult. But after a couple of tries, I got it. So yeah, I'm very happy that we got that one. That was a very nice one to get. And I wonder if there'll maybe be a moon around here. What in the world is that? What in the world is that? I've never been here in the regular game, so I don't know what in the world that is. This pipe is a trap. If you enter it, be scared or don't. There is a moon in here though, so you probably want to go in here. Okay, so I'm guessing that we want to head in there. <laughs> and there's a skull sign up here too. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna head in. Let's see what it is. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa! That's what that is! Oh! Oh! <laughs> wow! That is a lot of hammer bros. I don't think there's even a point in trying to avoid them. I think what you want to do is just just power your way through. Okay, and go down. Okay, 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 we made it past. Now what's here? Okay, back. Oh! That goes quite quickly. I didn't think it would go that quickly. What if I could get by these without taking damage though? Wouldn't that be funny? Okay, don't take damage now, Mario. Mario! Oh man, if you take damage by the fire, I don't think you can get by these. Wait! We actually almost made it, and I saw the moon in the background there. Okay, we've gotta do it, we've gotta do it! Damage moves, get by them, get by them, get by them! I wonder if maybe you get a heart for defeating all of them, that'd be cool. Okay, please go by! Why did I jump right there? <gasps> what?! Oh man, the way that we got that was unreal. That bounce there was unreal. I didn't think that we'd get that. I didn't think that would work. That was unreal. All right, and now I know what all these things coming out are. At first when I saw this, I'm like, what in the world is that? But now we have got another hide and seek moon. This might have been one of my favorite ones so far. I liked this one a lot. There'd be something back there perhaps? Back there is looking a little bit suspicious, if you ask me. Oh! This is looking a little sus- wait! Mario is swimming? What in the world is this? And there's an arrow pointing upwards. Do we listen to the arrow or do we go into that door? What do we do? Okay, I'll keep swimming up, okay? There's another arrow showing us to go- Oh, we're almost- Oh, man. You can only hold your breath for so long. Oh, no. I forgot that you can only hold your breath for so long. Oh, and you know what I just realized? There are actually lava bubbles on this island that we could capture, so we could get to that island in the background without actually taking any damage. So let's go here, and now... Let's swim up, let's swim up. I wonder if this is just like, you have to mash very quickly or what? Let's mash, let's mash. We are mashing, we are mashing. I'm going to continue going up just as fast as we can. We are mashing, 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 mashing. Mario's swimming up, swimming up, swimming up. Okay, are we going to start taking damage now? Look how far up we have gone, but I still don't see a moon. Why are we being told to swim up there? There isn't normally a moon like this, is there? Where's the moon? Wait a minute! Wait a minute. <gasps> How in the world are you supposed to get up there? How are you supposed to get up there? I don't know if my mashing wasn't good enough or what. I wonder if there's a top to that water or if that water goes up infinitely. I wonder how it works. I really, really wonder how it works. Are we supposed to use this height to get somewhere useful? Like, we can't make it over to there from here, can we? We can't go drop down into that pot from here, can we? I really hope that's not it. What could be intended here? Because I don't think that if we keep going up, we'll get a moon. At first, I was thinking that you'd have to swim high enough to go get to a moon, but I don't think that that's it. Wait a minute, wait a minute! I just realized, I, I just realized this, I should have noticed this earlier because this was a, this is a good idea. What you can just do is pop out, 
and then pop back into the water. So if you start to run out of breath, if you're not able to hold your breath for any longer, then you can just pop out and pop back in. And then you get all of your breath back. So that's what you have to do, probably. This way, we're able to get a lot higher. I thought that this was going to be a mashing test, but I didn't realize that it's going to be a riddle. So let's see. So our breath is running out. Then you just pop out and pop back into the water. Easy. Now, I wonder if you're supposed to go high enough to be able to make it into that pot, if that's what we're supposed to do, or if we are supposed to do something else. I wonder if maybe if we go high enough, then we'll get to a moon. I really wonder what it's going to be. Man, we are getting very, very high here. We are going very, very high above the level here. We're so high above the level that the music- <gasps> A power moon! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! This is what you are supposed to do! Okay, we made it up to the power moon. What a crazy spot for a power moon! This is incredible! I never thought that I'd be invisibly swimming up <laughs> some invisible column of water far above the level like this. This is unreal. This is absolutely unreal. The level just looks fake down there. Okay, so... I think we might want to make it up to that pot, but the cannon... There's normally a cannon that's down right there that launches the lava bubble up into the pot, but that cannon has been removed. So I think maybe we have to jump to there from here? Are we high enough to make it? Because I don't know how else we're going to make it up into that pot. No, there's no way we are making it from there. There's absolutely no way. We're going to have to capture three Goombas and bring them back to like near the beginning of the level because near the beginning of the level there's a thing that was telling us that we need um... Near the beginning of the level there's a thing that was telling us that we need three Goombas. Are there any more Goombas around here? I need some more Goombas. <gasps> I see a power moon! I see a power moon! I see a power moon! Okay, let's... Oh! Can I get the power moon though? Oh, I can't even get the power moon! That is such a great hiding spot for hide and seek, right under a bridge like that. Because from here, you can't even really see it. Unless you go like this. Once you go to snapshot mode, then you can see it. Okay, let's just... Let's try this. There we go! Alright, we got it, we got it, we got it. Hide and seek moon number two. Very nice, very nice. Can I land on that? Okay, Mario dies, but that's fine. That's actually a lot harder than I thought it would be. Now, where? Oh, on this moon, you could probably just get easily with the lava bubble. The way that I was doing it, I always do the moons in such a more difficult way than it has to be. You know what I haven't checked, though? Ah, would you look at that? You know what? In my video, I was even saying that I was thinking of putting a moon there because I was thinking that was a great spot for a moon. I was thinking that that's a very hidden spot, and there ends up being hidden moon number eight over there. That's great. So we almost put a moon in the same spot. That's very funny. I almost put my moon over there. I said in my video that that would be a good spot, but I didn't put my moon there. We've got to get up there. If we can get our Goombas over that cliff right there, then we can get another moon. But how do we get our Goombas up there? That is the question. Wait a minute. Ah, every time I see these forks the color, I'm like, it's a power moon, I found a power moon! And now the question becomes, how do I get these Goombas up there? Because there are no Hammer Bros around that can destroy this cheese. So I can't get up on this step, and these blocks just look like they're a little bit too high for me. It says shake the Pro Controller to jump higher, but... I don't have a Pro Controller, I'm guessing maybe you could do it with Joy-Cons? I guess maybe I'll have to try that. Okay, so now, I switched over to my Joy-Cons, and apparently... Oh my goodness, that is actually ridiculous how high you can jump! Now we can obviously get up here, oh my goodness, that makes things so much easier. I don't know if this would be possible to do otherwise, but yeah, now we can just go on and... Whoops. Well, we're almost dead, so we've got to be careful. But now, we can just capture these Goombas and bring them on over. Don't come near me! Get away from me! Oh, everyone here is all scared of the Goombas! Why are they so scared of the Goombas? 
Okay, there we go. We can head on up here. And I better not Joy-Con drift and fall into the lava. That would be rather unfortunate if that happened. Okay, but we now have all of our Goombas here. I was actually thinking that it's impossible to bring over these Goombas, but since you can do this, if you shake your Joy-Cons like this, man, that's, that's ridiculous that you unlock new controls by using Joy-Cons or a Pro Controller. That's rather unfortunate for people who don't use that. But there we go. Okay, hide and seek moon number three. That is fantastic. I don't think that we've tried this pipe, so let's go down here. I don't know if this is normally here. Okay, it's loading. Uh oh! <laughs> okay, uh, welcome to my PowerPoint presentation. Okay. I don't know if this is- well, I'm, I don't think that the PowerPoint presentation is normally in the game, but... What else? How did you get here? There's a grand total of one way to get to this room. Listed below are the possible ways to enter this room. One, entering that pipe you went in. If you want to avoid this room, don't enter this pipe. That's so funny. Okay. What can you do while you are here? Honestly, not much. No moons to collect. Oh, well, that's too bad. How many moons do you have so far? Zero, one, two, all ten, whatever it is. Good job. Okay. Here's a link to my YouTube channel. Why you, why you should subscribe to it. 42.2% funny videos. I make mods better than this one. I use Comic Sans in a PowerPoint presentation in Mario Odyssey. Uh, yes, great. This is fantastic. I guess I'll let you go now. Also, I lied earlier. You do get a moon! Hooray! Bye, good luck with the rest of the moons. That's amazing! Hooray, we do get a moon! I was wondering if we actually would get a moon or not. Wow, hide and seek moon number four. Okay, that's amazing! There's a moon over there, there's a moon over there, there's a moon! Over there, over there, there is in fact a moon. You know what, I thought this was a good hiding spot too. I almost put a moon over here. This was almost a spot where I put a moon. And I can't remember, is there a moon here normally in the game? I can't remember what, what is here normally in the game. That is the final hidden moon. So we have actually got all of the moons now. It looks like you didn't have to go up to the big pot at the top. After all, I thought that we'd have to go up there. And a big thank you to Amethyst for hiding these moons and even making the template mod that Rebox and I both use for this hide and seek challenge. Go check out Amethyst if you like Super Mario Odyssey. There's lots of great stuff there. Rebox and Amethyst have both played through my hide and seek mod that I made in Mario Odyssey. And I still have to play through Rebox's hide and seek mod soon too. And I've heard that that one is a really difficult one, so I'm getting pretty scared about that, so we'll see how that goes. I am wishing all of you an amazing day ahead of you. Thank you so much for watching, and take care, everybody.